So again, on another follow-up story. Any mina penanga is follow-up is yet unafanya and they're actually sweet and they're oh. nice. So a while back we had actually um, reported about Kevin Hart being in a really terrible mm-hmm. accident. Alafu wakenda silent for a while, yeah. so we were just like, what's what? going on? Kwanza, did you see the way that car was crashed into like a total wreck? Uh, yeah. So what happens is that he hurt his back and he could barely walk, he could barely move. He wasn't, he wasn't too vocal about his whole process, but now he's finally come out and he's showing how he's walking. He's even able to work out and he, show, he talked about how it's changed his whole perspective. It's changed his whole life. It's just inspirational. In, I feel like, I don't want to talk about it, otherwise we would have shared this on Monday, but yeah. we want you to like take a look at the video. Basically, would you realize that you're not in control? No matter how much you think you're in control, you're not in control. And at the end of the day, it can all be over, man. Actor and comedian Kevin Hart had to be hospitalized. Two other people had to be cut out of the car when it rolled off the road down an embankment. You know, when God talks, you gotta listen. And I swear life is funny. Because some of the craziest things that happen to you end up being the things that you needed most. And in this case, I honestly feel like God basically told me to sit down. You know, when you're moving too fast and you're doing too much, sometimes you can't see the things that you're meant to see. But after my accident, I see things differently. I see life from a whole new perspective. My appreciation for life is is through the roof. I'm thankful for my family, my friends. I'm thankful for the people that have simply ride with me and that have been with me because you stood by me. My fans. I'm thankful for all of your love and support. So don't take today for granted because tomorrow's not promised. More importantly, I'm thankful for God. I'm thankful for life. About a year, about about one year to whatever they recover, but yes. I'm not disrespecting them. Right. I'm not in a rush. I'm thankful for simply still being here. The road to being a bigger and better version of me. Looking forward to an amazing 2020.